Tac, bonjour, c'est Ron 86. Euh, je vais pas traîner parce que je. Voilà. Je regarde le direct en retard. Euh, je vais pas tarder à le lancer d'ailleurs, mais juste pour dire. Euh, je crois que j'ai vu. J'ai jamais vu de gens autant de res... si euh, disrespectueux. Parce que c'est-à-dire que du coup, là où j'enregistre euh, le direct, c'était il y a presque trois quarts d'heure. <rire> que ça. Qu'il avait commencé. Euh, J'étais en cours à ce moment-là. Les mecs à côté de moi étaient tous sur le putain de direct. J'étais en mode putain, faut que je regarde pas, faut que je regarde pas, faut que je regarde pas. J'ai réussi entre guillemets. Je me suis spoilé à une image, je sais même pas ce que ça veut dire. Et le site de Nintendo a m'a foutu le premier jeu. Bah, de toute façon, euh, ça va pas être une surprise pour le reste, ça va l'être. Euh, je suppose que vous avez déjà vu, donc euh, au pire, euh, on va y aller. Il me tarde de voir ce qu'ils se propose et j'espère qu'ils vont faire une putain de pause parce que c'est ce qu'ils méritent, c'est con quoi. Putain, j'espère qu'ils ont appelé Pokémon qui ont panique, ils ont dit euh, oui, euh, arrêtez de nous emmerder jusqu'à 2021, merci. Voilà. Ça, ça serait pas mal. J'ai pas beaucoup d'idées de quoi faire, donc voilà, allons-y. Juste pour le donjon mystère et tout. Welcome to the Pokémon Direct. I'm Ishihara from the Pokémon Company. In today's broadcast, le PDG de Pokémon like Company. Ah. Deux grands sujets. Let's get started with the first topic. Donc, have a look at the following footage. Deux annonces. 2006. Oh putain, ça date. Allez, stage. Et on. Bon, t'as assez dormi. Oui, c'est c'est Pokémon Donjon Mystère, voilà. Donc, 14 ans plus tard. Oh, wow, le style graphique. Ah, c'est ah, l'équipe de secours du coup qui a été repris. Oui, il est particulier ce style graphique. Il y a de nouveaux Pokémon. Et il y a les Mega Evolve. C'est nice ça. Bon, je suis juste un peu rebuté par le style graphique euh, première vue, mais bon. It's been about 15 years since Pokémon Mystery Dungeon, Red Rescue Team and Blue Rescue Team were released ouais, for the premier qui est sorti DS sur Game Boy Advance, Advance systems in et Japan. le deuxième, euh, oui, voilà, sur euh, Nintendo DS. Now they will gain a new life as a Nintendo Switch title. Pokémon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX ah oui, il sort bientôt. will be released March 6, 2020. Il est fini, comment peu après, ok. Bon, bah, il est déjà dispo, quoi. What's more, We'll release a demo oh, version today on Nintendo eShop shortly after this presentation. Ouais, comme ils ont fait pour, euh, You'll be able to carry over your save data to the full en fait, version euh. of the game once purchased, so please take this opportunity to get a sample of the fun. Alors, y a la voix Now, en fond, for the other topic, le traducteur anglais. I think we'll ask Game ah, Freak to Game share Freak it. Ça. Okay. Et, euh, les sous -titres français, Mr. Masuda, Mr. Omori, it's all Masuda yours. Masuda et Omori, ok. Masuda, forcément. Hello everyone, I'm Masuda from Game Freak. Hello, and I'm Amori, also from Game Freak. We hope everyone has been finding something to enjoy in the latest entries to the Pokemon series, Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield, since their release last November. Our goal is always to deliver lively new adventures that delight Pokemon trainers around the world. We did our best to fill these titles with fun activities so that our players could have a fulfilling experience. And the Galar region is a vast one. We suspect you've had many new discoveries and fun encounters along your adventure. We've been thinking about how much we'd like it if everyone's Pokemon adventures could go on even longer, with more to dig into ah, and new there, discoveries see. to explore. We've been working on plans for some time, in fact. This is why we at Game Freak are now developing the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Ooh, Shield expansion pass, extension a downloadable expansion for the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon nice. Shield games that will be available for purchase from Nintendo eShop. 
Until now, we've sometimes released new titles set in the same region as previous games, such as Pokemon Platinum version, ah, or Pokemon Ultra Sun, and Pokemon Ah, Ultra Moon. This expansion de Blanc will be different suite, from en fait. those games. You'll be able to set out on new adventures using the save data you're oh, already playing. Ça, we're in the thick of development now, but we've prepared some footage for you, so you'll be able to at least get a feeling of what the experience is awaiting you. Because that's a thing that I'm very tempted, but that I'm a bit surprised. I thought that the Terre Sauvage would be taken on the routes, except for the first ones. Let's go. Now you have Titi, my interest. Ah, you're going to go to the Terre du jeu du jeu notre aventure continue ah ils vont remettre flambuzard du coup ils ont déjà montré flambuzard ah il y a du contenu différent sur les versions oh une extension des terres sauvages ça c'est cool Pour les dresseurs Cool Custom son dresseur Ouh De nouveaux champions De nouveaux champions Putain Là c'était champion foison et champion pied, je reconnais les tenues Ah ils vont. Ils vont remettre les starters de, de la première version. Ouh Là il se dit les Gigamax. Oh il va aussi avoir des Gigamax sérieux. Oh ça va être génial. L'île solitaire de l'armure. Mais du coup comment on a les Gigamax et starters du coup Ça c'est une question que je me pose. Ah ça on est au sud par contre. Il wow, y a tellement de trucs. Une, une vieille église carrément. Tu on dirait un peu des... Regis, Regis, Rock, Regis, style, putain. Et Regis, gas... Oh de nouveau Regis en plus. Nouvelle évolution pour Ramolos. Et ça par contre je fais on dirait un peu les vieilles tenues de la team fair qui ont été refaites oh, oh s'il est putain mais le jeu il va il, il va durer 60 heures maintenant oh, attends c'est des c'est les dynamax des, de, des gens des oiseaux ou c'est des versions alt, ou c'est des versions de galard je crois que c'est des versions de galard ça oh putain c'est stylé sa mère les terres ont neigé de la couronne. En deux parties. Wouah Oh Oula, qui est-ce donc Le géant. Et son Gigamax. Version alternative de Version Eva Mazenta. Un nouveau légendaire. Oh. Nice. What did you think of this first look? Ah bah carrément là, je suis hype. The Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield expansion. Il y a un remix des champions d'arène en fond. Le Plan to be released in June 2020. And the Crown Tundra. Automne. Donc je pense pas qu'ils vont sortir d'autres jeux. Du coup. Il y aura juste les passes. Ah super. Ça coûte combien par contre Each part offers a different adventure. 
where you'll be able to visit unseen areas of the Galar region and meet plus, more people grand, and Pokemon plus. to live there. There are two versions of the expansion oh, packs, one for Pokemon versions, Sword and one for Pokemon Shield. Different Pokemon will appear in the different versions, and du you'll coup, also be able to see different people in places. Coup. We're hoping players can continue with the classic Pokemon experience of trading with one another and working together. Now, without further ado, let's have the director himself present more information on the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra. Du coup, il continue de, boss, de bosser, mais sur de l'extension, donc pas de gros jeux encore à venir, ça va. En plus, ça fait vraiment très bref. Aussi. I'm Tani from Game Freak. I'm working as the director for the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield expansion pass. The Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra are in development as we speak. So today, we'd like to show off some designs and concept art to help introduce you to these new areas. Your adventures in Galar are getting even bigger. First, let us introduce the Isle of Armor. Which focuses du perfectionnement. On the oh. Et on n'aime pas la moitié. Take a look. Les solitaires ça se base sur le perfectionnement. The next destination in your adventure is a giant island off the shores of the Gala region, known as the Isle of Armor. Mur. Okay. This island is full of beautiful nature. You'll find beaches, bars, forests, caves, and dunes. Et c'est vachement plus varié que les terres de base. You'll find Pokémon that you couldn't previously base. find in Galar Dwelling there too. There's a dojo for Pokemon battles on this Whoa. island. And you'll take up an apprenticeship under the Pokemon trainer who runs it. This is Mustard, who will become your mentor. Whoa. He's also the mentor of champion Leon, who you probably ah, know le, quite well. Le, in fact, de Mustard has occupied the seat of champion himself ah, in the putain, past. Lui, oh, il y avoir du lore, il y a du lore. new rivals among your fellow apprentices. When playing with the Pokémon Sword Expansion Pass, you'll be training with Clara, who is a Poison-type ah, user. Poison when playing with the Pokémon Shield Expansion Pass, you will be training with Avery, who is a Psychic-type user. They're both champions. training hard so they can someday ouais, voilà. have a gym and stadium to call their own. Next, we'd like to introduce the legendary Pokémon that will be central to the story. Cub Fu. <laughs> it's a fighting type Pokemon that strives to become stronger with single-minded dedication. As you progress through your training, Mustard will entrust oh. you with this Pokemon. Et un légendaire en plus. Once you complete your training together with Cub Fu, it will be able to evolve into Urshifu. There is single strike style, a fighting and Type dark type final, style that delivers a single strike at blinding speed. There's also rapid strike style, a fighting oh, oh. and water type style Absolute that focuses deo. on unleashing a torrent of rapid Absolute strikes. Ça, sympa. What's more, it's been revealed that Urshifu has a Gigantamax form. Each style will have a different appearance, as well as a different G-Max move. You'll be able to evolve your Cub Fu into an Urshifu in one of these two styles, single strike style or rapid strike style, during your adventure. Urshifu is a powerful Pokémon with a brand new ability, and it also has a new move for each of its two styles. Once you've completed your training, bring it with you for some online battles or official competitions. Ça, je le ferai sur ma propre partie parce que sur l'autre partie, je vais faire un Pokémon épée. J'ai pas le pass. And Intellion, final evolution of the first three Pokémon you team up with in the Galar region. During your adventure in the Isle of Armor, these special partners uh, in your teams team. will be able to Gigantamax. You can look forward to seeing their new forms and new G-Max moves. Ah, par contre, il change pas d'apparence, mais il se, here, il se place vraiment en mode sniper. The retour des doigts grumes et le charme qui fait. Ah! Ouh! 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 Ouh!
As it turns out, the Isle of Armor isn't the only uncharted area waiting for you all in the Gala region. In this frigid area, with its towering winter mountains, people live in small communities that support and rely on each other. Much like on the Isle of Armor, you'll be able to find Pokémon that didn't appear in the Gala region before. Fitting right in with this area's theme of exploration, there will be plenty for you to uncover. You might find a strange temple where you least expect it, or maybe spy a mysterious giant tree growing in a place it doesn't seem to belong. A certain person will appoint you as the leader of their exploration team in the Crown Tundra. Oh. You can gear up for adventure, and then head out to explore blizzard-swept fields, and even deep inside Pokémon dens, which you could only previously get a glimpse oh. of during Max Raid battles. Next, we'd like to introduce Calyrex, the legendary Pokémon you'll discover during your adventure. Legends say this Pokémon once ruled over a part of Galar that included the Crown Tundra. It's characterized by its graceful, regal movements. Get ready to experience a never-before-told story about the mysteries of Calyrex. The Crown Tundra will have a new form of co-op play as well. Oh. This will allow you and friends to enter and explore Pokémon dens that exist underground in the Crown ah, Tundra. Just de Red Dynamax, y a de Even inside the dens, you may see legendary Pokémon from past games Dynamaxing oh. before your eyes. You'll be able to meet and make allies of all kinds of legendary Pokémon yes. during your adventures in the Crown Tundra. Including ones you'll be able to catch through this co-op. Everyone is here. It also appears that some brand new legendary Pokémon are also waiting to be found somewhere in this land. Ouais, non, c est, c est en fait. And combined with the Isle of Armor, dozens of new clothing items will be added. Chez Rose, putain. Ouais, Plus there are new des, battles waiting fait, for you to en fait. challenge once you complete your entire game, including the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra. We can't go into the details of everything, but we're working on planning and developing Donc, new de ways régis, to enjoy Pokémon oiseaux. even as we speak. Le the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra areas themselves are actually two key La examples of the things we're working donc, on. Euh, Both areas are in fact seamless euh... maps, much like the wild area you can already experience in the Galar region, Ça where players are able to chose. move around freely and control the camera. Of course, you'll be able to connect with other trainers and play with them too. There will be Pokémon dens as well. Ouais, you'll be able to engage in max raid cool. battles against Pokémon that haven't previously appeared in the Gala region. Putain, ça va être énorme. Il y a une nouvelle coupe de champ. There's plus more to see and do on the Isle of Armor and in the Crown Tundra than there was even in the Wild area. We'll bring you more information about them in future news reports, so please stay tuned. Il reste encore un peu près 4 minutes. Ils ont encore des choses à dire, je pense. What did you think? We at Game Freak are all working hard to bring you new content. So you can spend more time having fun in the Galar region. We hope you're as excited as we are for what's to come. Thank you, Mr. Tani. On the Isle of Armor and in the Crown Tundra, you'll see some familiar Pokémon that didn't appear in the Galar region before. There will be more than 200 Pokémon species that nouveau. appear in these areas, and you can add to your team, including the legendary Pokémon mentioned before. Donc le Pokédex grimpe à 600 quoi. Additionally, we'll be distributing free updates ah. for Pokémon Sword and Pokémon Shield that will coincide with the releases of the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra. Si vous pouvez notamment corriger quelques bugs de l'online. These updates will allow people who don't have the Pokémon Sword and Pokémon Shield expansion packs ah, to obtain cool. the Pokémon that appear on the Isle of Armor and in the Crown Tundra through euh... other means, such as trading. Faire les échanges, ça c'est nice. Players will also be able to bring over Pokémon to their games ah, from the cloud service okay, Pokémon Home as long as the Pokémon appear in the Pokémon Sword and Pokémon Shield expansion ouais. packs. Donc pas tous, mais une... Pokémon Home peu près is planned to launch in February 2020. Donc il sort le mois prochain. We intend to release even more details before then, so please wait just a little bit longer. Finally, we have some more news for our Pokémon ah. Sword and Pokémon Shield players. Starting today, it seems like you're more likely to run into Gigantamax Colossal, Ooh. Gigantamax Lapras, and Gigantamax Flapple or Gigantamax Appleton in max raid battles in the ah, wild cool, Face these powerful Pokémon with your friends. There will also be a software update going live shortly after this presentation. Ah, okay. Once you've received the update, head to Wedgehurst Station. 
In Pokemon Sword, you'll encounter Clara. While in Pokemon ah. Shield, you'll run into Avery. You'll also encounter a Galarian Slowpoke that's wandered in from the Isle of Armor. You'll be able to catch it and add it to your team. Galarian Slowpoke can evolve into Galarian Slowbro if you use an item that can be found on the Isle of Armor, or into Galarian Slowking if you use an item that can be found in the Crown of Tundra. Don't forget to check it out. What did you think? Today, we've finally been able to show you some of what we at Game Freak are hoping to achieve going forward. We hope we've been able to get you excited for the continuing adventures waiting for you in the Isle of Armor and the Crown Tundra. The expansion pass is the first for the core Pokemon series. We'll do our best to fill it to the brim with adventures like you've never experienced before. Whether you're just starting with Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield, or you've done everything there is to do, we'll do our best to develop something that everyone can enjoy. Stay tuned for more updates in the future! My thanks to everyone from Game Freak. The Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield expansion okay, bah, pass, which contains both the Isle of bon. Armor and Alors, the Crown Tundra, will be available for free purchase on Nintendo eShop shortly after this presentation. You'll also be able to On access Nintendo chier? eShop directly from the Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield menu once you install the latest update for your game. As a special purchase bonus, we've also prepared some clothing items that can be used <laughs> starting today. Pokemon will continue to try new things in 2020 to bring fun and joy to people around the world. Thank you for tuning in. Eh ben, plutôt content, sincèrement. Hein. Bon, j'ai la hype. Et au moins, c'est un petit peu un bon signe pour moi parce que ça veut dire qu'ils vont pas concentrer tous leurs efforts pour déjà redévelopper un gros jeu Pokémon. C'est sympa. Voilà, donc du coup, euh, merci d'avoir regardé. Oui, je vais arrêter là. Euh, bah, j'ai hâte de voir votre avis en commentaire. N'oubliez pas le pouce bleu, le partage euh, et l'abonnement. Si vous voulez pas manquer mes éventuels let's play. Euh, je vous dis eh bien, à bientôt pour de prochaines vidéos. Allez, bye bye. Ciao